Before starting with today's video, I want to share one thing with you that this project is one of the most challenging and difficult project which I made till date. But I am very glad to share with you because this is one of the extreme makeover of complete waste which we throw off. So let's go ahead with the video. As you can see in this video that these are the online lampshade which are beautiful but quite expensive. So I decided why not making a ceramic look-alike lampshade all by myself and share with you. So the material which I could use was POP over cardboard which was quite challenging for me to make because these are made by professional masons. However, I am extremely glad to share that the project really came out very well and it gave a positive ambience at my home. Hi friends, welcome to my YouTube channel Papia Vlogs. So friends, whatever project which we make, we make it for you and we make it with lots of pride and hopes. Since we are YouTuber, we have lot of responsibility in guiding you in the right way. So friends, in today's project, this is an extreme makeover of a complete waste which you will come to know once you see the video thoroughly. So friends, ये जो मैंने बनाया है lampshade, ये आप किसी भी festivals में use कर सकते हैं, अपने home decorations के लिए भी use कर सकते हैं. But the thing, the lamp which you can see looks easy but trust me it is quite challenging to make it is not at all a easy project so friends as my dear friends and viewers all i can request to you is since we give lot of efforts time and energy i would request and appreciate that if you like my videos like my project please do not forget to give it a thumbs up Share it with your friends and family in WhatsApp, Facebook and any social networking site. And most importantly, if you are new to my channel, Papia Vlogs at YouTube, please do not forget to subscribe to my channel with the bell and all option on. Friends, your support, motivation encourages us a lot to make new things, new projects for you in a different manner. I hope you will understand my feelings, my emotions and at the same time you will appreciate my effort. So friends, just look into the video completely and if you like it, do not forget to give it a like, share and do not forget to subscribe to my channel Papia Vlogs at YouTube. So without wasting further time, let's go ahead with the project today. Friends, as you can see this beautiful lampshade in the video, this is made out of complete waste. You would be amazed to see what is the waste item I have used and it's almost a zero budgeted project. I am glad to share because this was one of the most challenging project which I have made it till date, the reason of which I will tell you in the video itself. So let's get started with the tutorial of this project. Friends, let me tell you that you can use this beautiful lampshade not only to decorate your home during any festivals like Diwali, Durga Puja, Christmas or New Year. However, you can use this lampshade to decorate your home throughout the year and this looks exactly like this during the night time now friends time to know what i have used well the waste material which i have used is the empty boxes of sweets we get exactly like this and this box is quite sturdy and this is one of the best you can use to make this project i hope after watching this video you will never throw the sweet boxes like this the next item which we would be requiring this is the main item that is the gypsum plaster which is also called as the plaster of paris this 2 kg cost me only 45 bucks and we need a tissue paper or a thick sheet like this which we get out of calendar which we can use it fevicol a spatula or a spoon to mix the pop then a scissor and a knife the knife which i have used is the normal cutting knife however you have to use the craft knife which unfortunately mm -hmm. i did not get it mm -hmm. through any shop or online 
so i'm using the regular knife to cut the cardboard now i take the box here and first thing which i do is i would be drawing any uh, figure which i want to so now i have like uh, sketched it a mark so that i can cut off the extra edges of the paper of the sheet and now i here draw a heart shaped figure you can draw any figure of your choice but make sure that there should not be too much of curves in the figure because too much of curves would make your cutting part cutting process very difficult now i am here cutting the sheet the calendar sheet you can use or any thick sheet so that i can paste it over the box the idea behind pasting the tissue paper or the sheet over the box is to make the surface of the box little bit rough so that the pup get fixed over the box easily and remains intact over a longer period of time next i have attached the heart shape over the box and trace it like this with a pen so that i can easily cut it off by the mark of the pen after cutting it looks like this and over the mark of the pen i will start cutting with a plain knife however a hobby knife or a craft knife would be advisable the link of which i will try to give in the description box below after cutting the desired shape it looks like this even if the surface is rough don't worry because it would be covered with the paper which i would be pasting with the fevicol and then we would be using the pop and then we can get a finished uh, shape so don't worry even if the shape of the heart as you can see in the video is little bit rough however this would be rectified later once you use the pop now i take the pop in a bowl for this project i required around 1 cup of pop wherein i have used fevicol and water in 2 is to 1 ratio where fevicol was 2 and water was 1 however when you mix it you will automatically come to know the consistency should be like this as you can see in the video now this pop is ready to be pasted over the box which we would be pasting like this as shown in the video in upward motion the stroke of the brush should be applied in one single direction either in upward or downward however the bottom to top if you go it should be in the upward motion and top to bottom you should go in the downward motion now here is a word of caution that when you apply pop make sure that the pop mix should be applied over the box as soon as possible otherwise the pop gets hardened and it's difficult to apply now when the pop gets little bit dried up apply little bit of water in your finger and give it a nice finishing smooth texture like this and cut off the extra edges of the paper and apply pop all over the box as shown in the video next you require a flint paper or sand paper and cut it into a small square shape like this and start rubbing the surface of the pop as shown in the video so that you get a smooth surface of the lamp shade now i have started cutting the extra edges of the cardboard and have started rubbing with the sand paper now once we have achieved the smooth surface of the lamp shade the next step is to color it so i am using the acrylic white spray here you can use the white gloss or the matte finish i am using the white gloss and spraying the inside and outside of the lamp like this now to cover the top side of the lamp shade i am taking a silver sheet as you can see in the video and cutting two pieces of cardboard and pasting it with a fevicol so that we can cover the upper side of the lamp shade after fixing the cover is ready now to decorate the heart shape i have used the tissue cloth which is again a waste material which comes with the flower bouquet if you have seen This is the same tissue cloth which was lying waste at my home so I have decided to use it. So I will cut it in the shape of the heart and I have pasted it with the fevicol. Now I have decided to decorate the lamp a little bit more 
with a white lace like this i have fixed the lace in the top side and the bottom side of the lamp and now i take a lamp like this this is a battery operated led light which can illuminate the lamp and i am using this cover to cover it so now see this beautiful lamp is ready now friends i want to share something with you as in the beginning of the video i said that this project was one of the most challenging project which i have made till date and the challenge was applying pop over the cardboard which is not easy as it is done by professionals let me tell you that i have used pop to get the ceramic like texture to make this lamp shade and the online price or if you go and buy this kind of ceramic textured lamp shade it would be quite expensive however the end result is superb and i am glad to share with you that this lamp shade came out really well above my expectations and i hope you liked it too so if you like my video please do not forget to subscribe to my channel with the bell and all option now so that you get regular notifications of my videos and if you like my video please do hit the like button and share it with your friends and family members so thank you so much for watching this video stay tuned for my next video till then bye bye